Question two, they've all got these LUNs in them, which is the special case here when you have U equals LUN X, because when you differentiate the LUN X, you get one over X. And you let dv by dx be the other bit. Now, here, what do you think? Well, it's just a three. When you just have one ln x here, people never know what to put. But what is it times v, those two bits times together, minus the integral of the two things you've just worked out? Now, that times by that, 3x times by 1 over x, the x is going to cancel, leaving you just with 3. And so the answer is 3x ln x minus integrate the 3 gives us another 3x and put the plus c on the end. So I'll do b as well. So for b, we're doing x ln x dx. Same thing u is equal to ln x which differentiates to give 1 over x the other part is x which integrates to give a half x squared so the integral becomes a half x squared ln x minus the integral of these two things times together which is a half x squared divided by that x just leaves us with one of those x's there dx so the answer, a half x squared ln x minus this power goes up by one, divide by the extra two and the plus c on the end as usual.